Are you in the market for a trail running vest but don't want to spend big bucks? In this video I'll be reviewing one of the cheapest hydration running vests you can buy. In fact, it's the exact one this running guy is wearing. So stick around and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button to see more products reviewed. Let's go! So this is the cheapest running vest you will find on AliExpress. It's called Top Speed. It sometimes has different names. I've owned this one for three years now and I got it as a kit bundled with two 500ml water bottles and a two litre water bladder as you can see. As I said, the one that you're looking at in this video is already three years old, so it will look a little bit older, but this is still what they look like and is the current version being sold. The bag itself is made out of an ultralight water resistant and tear resistant nylon, polyester lining, it's got breathable mesh, it's pretty strong stuff. It's what's called five litre capacity and it's got loads of pockets and straps and loops on which to hold stuff or hang stuff from. There's an internal pocket to keep your keys safe, and an adjustable chest strap system that slides up and down on rails as you can see. So let's load in the water bladder. This is a two litre water bladder. I've put about one litre of water into this and we'll feed the hose through the openings and also through the straps up on the front of the vest. We'll also insert the 500 ml water bottles up on each side, like so. Okay, I'll try to give you an idea what this running vest looks like. It's got the two litre uh, water bladder inside already. It's probably only about a litre of water in there. Now let's put this thing on. Okay, so we've got these chest buckles and you'll notice they're on some slide rails. There's up and down, up and down. Now you kind of think that that's a good thing, but I'll show you why it's actually not a very good idea. First of all, let's adjust it to my chest. Then you just tighten it. Okay, one of the issues that I have with these chest strap systems is that even if you start down here, as you start to run, these things start to slide up and up and they go all the way up and there's really no stopping it. I'm gonna show you another running vest very soon that I've got that actually stops that, but this is just something you need to know and be aware of. So it's up to you how you wanna keep your water bladder, whether like that, whether just down. Maybe you don't want it in this little strap system here and you might wanna just put it straight up here like that. I like to have it underneath the chest strap here that way it doesn't just uh, bang all around in front like this. But each to their own, it's just what I prefer. I like having it tucked away. Something like that works fine. Going now with our water bottles. Now these are 500 mil ones. So when we chuck them in like that, put the other one into the other compartment and there you go. Now, you've got a couple of these oh no, elastic bands. What I like to do with these is these kind of flip flop around and to be honest, what the heck, it's like guns. I don't really like them like that. So I personally like to strap it around like this. And what I do with this clip system, I bring it around. If you can see that and that secures it nicely. I'll do the same thing over here, like that. You'll notice it's adjustable up on the sides here. Okay, if I can just show the angle correctly. I don't really care much for these types of bottle systems. I don't really like to run with them and I'll show you why. Let me just get these out. A lot of places where I go, I take a lot of photos or do a quick bit of filming and footage uh, just for YouTube videos and, and whatever. And so I need quick access to my phone. I don't like running with it around my waist or in my pockets, uh, just because of the type of clothing that I wear when I run. So this vest is exceptionally great for my phone just to sit right there. And I've got quick access to it. Okay, in here in your pockets, you can have your keys, you can have your lollies, your muesli bars, whatever you want, but I like to have quick access 
to my phone. The other thing as well, sure, this is fine, this is okay, but I prefer this. This is also 500 mils, okay, and these types of bottles fit in beautifully. And this just goes around the top, secures it in place, and boom, okay. That's just me. Is it in the way? No, I don't feel it is. Some people may not like it, which is maybe why they will prefer that. But each to their own. Some people love this. Uh, I find it a little bit of a struggle to, yeah, as it gets a bit empty, there's less and less water in it. So it's getting more and more tucked away. And I'm really oh, oh, trying to cramp over to have a drink from it. You know, and I don't really want to pull it out because as less and less water come in here, it really is a pain to try to tuck it back in and then to, you know, strap it down, which is why, give me any day, one of these types of bottles. Boom, boom, and off I go. And so, you know, even if it gets a bit empty, doesn't really matter, mate. Back in, boom, and off I go. It's so much more easier than this but that's just me. Now, like I said before, this chest system, not the greatest because you'll see how it's slid up. Even though I have it down there, it just tends to creep up. So that's a really big downfall of having, I think it's called a rail system, okay? Not my cup of tea, but for the price, I can't complain compared to other vests I was looking at up on the market. It's really great value and that's really, you know, a very minor point, just given the price that you pay for this. Just to give you an idea. Like the running man. So once again, a very, very budget type of setup, but Highly recommended if you want to get into a bit of running or trail running. I'm not a marathon runner or anything like that, but I enjoy going out off on the trails. And this is a bit of a game changer, to be honest, than running with something around your waist. I can see up on AliExpress, this running vest, you'll probably be paying about $20 to $25. You can get a two liter water bladder, plus two of these 500 ml bottles. All up, including shipping, will cost you about $40 Australian, which isn't too bad for what you get. This is called a five litre capacity, and it actually does fit quite a lot of stuff. However, something to be aware of is if you are putting the water bladder into it, you're not really gonna have much storage, especially if you fill it up with water, you're not gonna have much storage in there for much else. So it all depends on you know, how you wanna use this. However, I have recently ordered a brand new vest and it's from the Aonije. <laughs> I don't know how you pronounce that. Aonije uh, company. I'll be reviewing that one next. This is it. This is a different beast altogether. So stay tuned for the next video, which I will show you a review on that particular running vest. Where'd it go?